Stay in two McGuars and welcome back to another episode of McGuire 5 Mercenaries as we continue the campaigns of Lego Legion Mc2. And last time, well, we've basically been just absolutely raiding and pillaging and blasting our way throughout the entirety of, well, not the Inner Sphere, mostly the Davian Curtain border, but we've had a lot of fun doing it and slowly moving up the ranks. We'll probably be heading to a slightly more difficult area today, so with that in mind, uh, let us get things out of the way. I'm joined, of course, by K Ogre, Wild Moon Moon, and Talik, as also known as Arjak, as we continue uh, ripping through things. See, uh, Hello. Congrats. I think I'm between Hello, rank four and five. So, House Lao, they will get your back. Yes, House Lao will absolutely watch your back for you. Right up until the point they put the knife into it. So, right into New Hessen, there's a rare mecha. They there. wouldn't stab you in the back. They'd stab you in the front. I think they'd stab you in the front, the back, and then shoot you from behind as well. Sprogue heading off to bed. Oh no, that, that means we're about to have technical difficulties because Sprogue is heading to bed. <laughs> Without fail, that has seeming to, seemingly been the thing. Ooh, there's a rare enforcer on sale. It is the 4P with an AC-20. It's also oh a Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's got an AC-20, two medium lasers, and a small. It's basically a hunchback, except in enforcer that is, form. That is pretty scary. <laughs> it's also very expensive. It's, it's a hunchback that uh, also moves fast. That is true. Well, Although, we can't fuel it anyway because of the tonnage limit, so... Ooh, it has a double heatsink in it. By the way, the other equipment mod, very useful for freaking these things out. Looks like a Hunchback 4J showed up in the market. There is a Vindicator. Oh, it's an Avenging Angel Vindicator. There's actually a lot of really good gear here. Now, let's first fix up our battle mechs and then determine oh, what we want to sell. Vindicator being 45 ton might be a little bit more doable. Yeah, I think so, because we've been running about 10 tons under the limit anyway, and we're going to be moving to a more difficult zone. So that'll be pretty good. I don't think we need any of the locusts, but we are definitely keeping the other javelin. So let's go to the market. Inventory. And we have a couple of broken locusts that I'm getting rid of. Where are they? That's one. Remember to dump everything into cold storage and blow it back out. Yeah, there is that. I probably should be doing that. I'm just incredibly lazy. Also, most of the stuff is pretty broken. Alright, so we have 4.7 million seabills. We haven't yet gone through our inventory to shell out all of the junk. Like that uh, burst fire AC-10. We probably don't have nearly as much junk as we had last time. Although we have 8 medium lasers that are totally useless. Because they're the bad kind. A whole bunch of LRM 10s. Actually, a whole bunch of LRM 10s that even that we can sell in the normal version. And. Yeah, we're going on. So we have 5.4 million Seabills. Nice. I need, of course, to. See if they have any SRM 6s to dump into our Javelin. Exactly. That's what I'm doing right now. Ooh, they've got some good ones, too. I'm going to buy all of those. In fact, I'm going to buy most of these. Actually, no, I shouldn't. So that will actually fix up our javelin quite nicely. They're all. Strip off the broken junk, which is mostly just jump jets. Because we were quite... Oh well, the center torso actually is fully intact. So I actually didn't even need to do that, but it's going to have upgraded missiles, which will be lovely. Uh, let's max armor that, and... Okay, so it's losing us jump jets, but it's getting max armor. So I think that's a reasonable trade. Yeah, it kind of needs a max armor when it's in people's faces shooting missiles. Yep. So that'll actually be pretty solid. So that's actually our entire lance all fully set up and ready to rock now. Uh, yeah, let's, let's, you're, you're not allowed. I don't allow this junk. Oh, I'd have to do this properly. Right. You spammers. Pretty much. So now I have to actually go in and set this thing up right because I'm going through the pop-out menu on this. I haven't done this before because normally I have Spoke to do this for me. Do I do this? Let's see. Ban user. Goodbye. See, now that I've figured out how to ban people, you all best to be unnoticed. Alright, back to the game. So we've got all our mechs picked up. We've got 4.5 million C bills. If we were to sell one of our good mechs, we would actually be able to buy one of the one of the more expensive mechs currently on sale at the moment. 
because they are currently offering the Avenging Angel. It does need a bit of a tune-up. Uh, it's missing a small laser and it's jump jets, but other than that, it's actually in pretty good shape. And we can actually afford it right now because it's only 3.7 million Zeebles. So what do you guys think? Do we buy an Avenging Angel Vindicator? Yeah. I say we sell the Airbnb by the Vindicator. I'm on board with that. I'm only trying... To that. Say again? What's the price difference to that Enforcer, the AC2? Uh, the Enforcer is 5.2 million Seabills, so it's a little outside of our league. So we can actually afford the we can afford the Avenging Angel right now. If we were to sell the Urban Mech, we would be able to afford the Enforcer, but we would have to, you know, get the the ire of Sprogue. Uh, I don't think an Enforcer is worth the ire of Sprogue. <laughs> nah, Avenging Angels, they, they, they're pretty good, them Vindicate. Yeah, we can armor it up. We'll buy the Avenging Angel. Uh, Riddick, we're currently playing with a couple of house rules, one of which being we're only allowed to use 70% of our tonnage, so the Wolverine's going to be a bit much. We're, we're most of the time not even able to field our crab, so because of that, we're limiting ourselves to an extra thing. So let's go fix it up properly. Repair everything. Do I have a better PPC for this? I don't. I'm seeing two jump jets and a small laser. Small laser I can provide. Although, honestly, I'd pr probably give you a medium laser. Especially with the new jump jet bonus. I literally don't have jump jets to give you. Never mind. That'll work. So you can get a better laser and more armor. Mostly more armor. It definitely needs more armor. It does. Let's remove all of his jump jets. Max armor. Still not full armor. What are we up to? Uh, we're getting close, actually. The thing is, I don't want to rob it of any of its heat sinks because, you know, it's a Vindicator. Kind of needs them. Alarm 5 kind of works on it. The medium laser kind of works on it. Do you have a better LRM? Really don't. LRM 10s if you want to sacrifice the lasers. Can we go up that high? How many tons? 5 tons versus 2 tons? Uh, we don't quite have the tonnage for that. Not without dropping some uh, some heat sinks. We'll go keep the LRM 5 because this is actually a fairly reasonable anti-aircraft weapon. We got it most of the way to heavy armor. We'll see about changing that in the future at some point. So that'll be repaired sometime soon. And I think... Oh yeah, barracks. You ready to stop wasting my time? Let's see if we can't find a good pilot. Uh, our pilots are currently minimum pilot level of 20 and all of these pilots suck. So we're not, we're not buying any of them. Star map. There's another rare mech over in Holorn, but we're kind of out of cash. Second. It took me ages to find a better pilot in this game. Yeah, we'll have to head out to more deeper, dangerous things. I think we want to take on a uh, a level seven contract. It is available. What we, is the, we can do it. You could probably do it. Let's give it a shot. Heading to Hunan. Oh God, we should not be going here. <laughs> so we've just shown up in Hunan. Uh, everybody make sure there's no shore leave and nobody's allowed off the ship without a mask and once you come back it's going to require full decam decontamination. What happened at Hunan? Isn't that where uh, the coronavirus started? Or maybe I'm thinking of something else. Oh, that's oh no, no, that is, yeah, you're right. Wuhan, there we go, that's closer. It's close enough. Right, battle next. Uh, the javelin still needs a little bit of repair time, which we will give it. It only needs six days. So that gives us a javelin and a vindicator. Oh, that's actually really nice. Who painted that? I did. That's nice. We still also have a javelin that needs a paint job if somebody wants to grab it. Well, I go set up a contract. Difficulty 32. This is roughly twice as difficult as what we've been doing. Are they going run to the heavies. And it's going to be 230 tons maximum, which translates for us to... Two, three, zero, times, four, seven, equals 161 tons. We have weight to spare, folks. So uh, don't worry about that. We should actually be able to probably field everything we've got. So if anybody wants to jump up to the Vindicator. If not, I'm taking the Vindicator. You but want Are you happy in your Locust, Kyogre? Ah, oh, he's switching. <laughs> he's definitely not happy. <laughs> He's got the javelin. Anybody want to step up to the Vindicator? We do have the tonnage for it. We've got 15 tons to spare. Yeah, might as, might as well. 
If you don't want to, you like, don't have to. I feel like we're gonna need it. Oh, Do you want a spider? I'll take the spider. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's fine. I'll take the spider. You can go both run around are, with Indicator. With both are phenomenal. Super fast PPP. And SRMs those, to the face. This will happen. Yes, those are two, three SRMs too, so they should be pretty powerful for you. So, I think the weakest mech in this lineup is probably mine. <laughs> Despite being the heaviest. All yeah, I've got probably. Is, all I've got is a pair of ER larges. What can I do? Uh, you can take six. Although, if you hit head. something with an alpha, it's gonna hurt. Yeah, if I can, if I can get somebody under all of my guns at the same time. But that will require a little bit of work. I'm liking the more eclectic look that we've got going in this season. Last season, everything was completely uniform. We used the exact same color codes for everything. And this time, we're just sort of going, go nuts with it. It's a pirate Not campaign. really is a merc company. <laughs> exactly. Well, you know, we picked up all these mechs at discount stores and whatever. Whatever paint job, we just don't have the fun. Oh, that's a pretty cool paint job on the tablet, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did that one too because I thought it would be kind of cool to look like a little uh, reactor. Kind of like being shot. Sensors online. We are. Weapons I'm gonna have to get that online. mod that makes the uh, that does takes away the the damage nerf to the leopard. Because apparently it only does like 40% damage or something like that with its weapons. Okay, I'm just gonna hurt this hurt this spider until it gives up. I am struggling with the heat already. So once we get this guy under control, then there we go. Just gotta get back, get back mentally sorted into the mindset of a crab pilot. Basically, I need to remember that I have one of the best side torsos in the entire game, and some of the weakest. Igor's, Igor's dead. Oh, oh no. He this is gonna get rough then. That stage. Yeah, if we're gonna be fighting Igor's, that's gonna get rough real quick. Well, you have VR large lasers, so. <laughs> that is true, I'll keep my head on the swivel. Oh, we got a heavy. It's a quick draw. Okay, so it's a totally reasonable heavy. Also got a couple of VTOLs. I'm gonna keep picking at the, uh, at the quick draw. If anybody else wants to shoot at the VTOLs. Uh, oh, the quick draws our primary target. We kill him, we leave. Heat critical. No, my lasers are in range for you, sir. Nice. Yeah, I need a better targeting computer. Give me more of the zoom. Try and hit his legs. I don't think it's working. Let me get a little bit closer. There we go. Now I'm getting some damage on in there. Let's keep the keep that damage of burning in it. Oh gosh, Igor's. Do you want me to focus on the Igor's or keep on plinking at this quick draw? Nah, the quick draw is fine. Somebody took out the Igor. I did. Nice. System oh, taking a nap. <laughs> Being too aggressive with this thing, I need to kind of give it some time. Oh, nice shot with that PPC. Legs are almost up. I'm starting to push maximum heat back in on this. Oh, he's gonna... Ooh, right to the edge of that one. So his legs are almost out. Once we can nail those. It'll be nice and simple. Okay, that's one down. That's both legs down. Lance dropping. Oh, Jesus, right on top of me. Time to go. What do we got? Uh, <laughs> Jaeger mech. That's a Jaeger mech. That's oh, well. We don't well. have the salvage for it. Yeah, we don't have the salvage for it. If we did, oh god, we would take it. Maybe we need to get just a salvage Where bonus mod. That Javelin F is almost dead. Not He's back there. Nice. Nice kill and nice ragdoll. Target acquired. Should have taken this for more money. Could just sit back the whole time to plink the way. go where no spider has gone before. On top of the jump ship. Oh, mission over. I thought I had shut down my own mech doing that one. 
Oh, and that was my favorite Jaeger back. The Jaeger A. Now, is that the one with the, um, the fives and the twos? Hmm? No, that's the no, one that's with the a one whole bunch of missiles. Oh, the good one. Because in, uh, well, in Rogue Tech, you can, well, not just in Rogue Tech and Vanilla, you can mount up with LRM 15s on those, and they are just nasty. Because the amount of damage they shove out is just ridiculous, and really the stability damage. So, there's the quick drop. <laughs> no way, come on. <laughs> we can't afford it, but there it is. We can admire it from afar. Uh, looking for... That would be such a great Let's get some more medium lasers. I like my mech. Oof, that jab damage. Holy crap. What do we do? Nice! Oh, uh, he's probably gonna become the new uh, top top damage dealer on the Lance. Well, so, I ended up eating a lot of damage, but yeah. Sorry about that. That's okay. It should be relatively quick. Six days on that one. Sixteen days on that one. Okay, a little bit more. Six days on the Avenging Angel and four days on the Crab. Alright, do it. No more contracts here, so it is time to travel. Uh, do I want to go to... I think we'll go to Ashkam. 20 day trip. We'll get us all nice and patched up by the time we get there. Unless I just broke my game again. Oh no, I misclicked. So that'll fix up most of our mechs. We'll be ready to rock and roll. The enemy will not know what hit them. It's gonna be glorious. I can probably try and pick up a two mission, multi mission. Yeah, we probably have the, the stuff to do it with. So we'll keep an eye out on that. Long run contracts which should be fun. How about a three mission operation? <laughs> that well, might be a bit much. If you don't take that much damage in the first mission, you can technically repair it. Yeah, true. Well, if you guys think it's good enough, we can give it a shot. I mean, it's good for 27 what are the salvage. Three missions? What, are their, what are their types? Uh, how do I tell that? It's two. Oh, I see. Raid, demolition, right raid. There. Yeah, yeah. So it'll be a raid, a demolition mission, then another raid. That is very doable. Yeah, if we're quick and aggressive, we can definitely pull this one off. Yeah, if we want salvage, you just have to like lit something down really fast and then leave. Yep, we have our full tonnage on this one. So we can actually drop down hard with this. And we'll be sort of on the lookout for heavies that we can rob. Because with 27 salvage, I mean, you're taking pretty much any heavy on the list. And that's per mission, which is great. Yep. So, lots of cash, lots oh, of potential. Did the mods fix that? Hmm? Did the mods fix the salvage for the multi-mission deployment? Uh, I haven't heard any mods to change it, but I thought it just did that normally. Yeah, Sometimes not so it. much. Oh. That's gonna suck if that's not the case. We'll have to cross our fingers and hope. But hey, we're experimenting and exploring. If anybody wants to take the javelin, just let me know. I'm pretty comfortable. We I mean. really need a better pilot for that javelin. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. We got to switch that pilot. Um, with the Vindicator. Yeah, switch. Yeah, uh, I'm mostly energy. Yeah. Yeah, switch those two pilots and that should, that'll give him a little bit more bonus than he needs. That way he gets uh, the most out of his potential missile. Yeah. But we definitely do need to find some pilots. <laughs> it's becoming a bit of a problem. Some high level people. Alrighty. We need to find a couple more javelins with missiles. That would be terribly scary. I know that would hurt me in my soul to have to drive a javelin like that. <laughs> Until Just imagine you four of them running at you. I know, it's it's much more powerful. I just I'm not a fan of the Diablo in terms of mech design, so it does look Reactor like a gang to online. Sensors. Yeah, my online. preference is definitely lean towards Weapons one online. Well actually no, the crab legs. The, All systems this non particular non crab's legs are really cool to me. Because they they've got like a switchback thing going towards them and I like it a lot. That's what, did it degrade? You'll have to uh, I thought Digi-Degrade was just site. reverse leg. This area is heavily so guarded, this is like a so step on beyond just complexity and beauty. Which is one of the reasons why I'm really disappointed that when they brought the champion over out to uh, MechWarrior Online that they didn't use this leg design. Yeah, that's an AC-10 Igor. It was, and he nearly ripped off my arm. I'm hurting now. 
we've got to keep our range a little bit because we are we're definitely pushing the edge on what we can sort of afford in terms of damage so i hope you'll excuse me but i'm not putting my my very expensive crab in much danger oh no please don't be stuck okay good Also, yeah, I've got some you know, of these, a 700 uh, eco range. pilots are elite rank. Oh, that's gonna be unpleasant. That's a uh, secure just ran face first in two. Do you help? That's uh, fine. Yeah, my ERLR's lasers basically let me cheat by sitting at maximum range. Got his leg. Oh yeah, you guys got cicadas Target rushing destroyed. on in. At the end of the day, is this cicada? There's so it's all really sorts of things going on. It's such a big oh, mech geez. for how little firepower brings. Okay, got a good hit on his legs. Somebody popped. Heat critical. His legs are almost over. Oh, just his right leg left. Good job, okay. Target Just gonna keep critical. beating the crap Target out of vehicles destroyed. while you uh, tear apart the base on the inside. Not allowed to hit me from this range. There's Stop. a lot of turrets in that base. Oh, taking a nap. Polonovich, subscribe for Twitch Prime. Uh, they've been subscribed for two months, currently at a two month streak. Thank you very much, man. I do appreciate the support. Not quite sure why it didn't pop up on my thing, but dude, thank you so much. Support really does help, you know, allowing me to make the time for this sort of thing in a busy schedule. And I really do appreciate it. Every single one of you. Alright, So my right arm's a little bit dented, but otherwise than that, the mech's actually in pretty good shape. I should probably be able to bring this into another mission. Assuming, of course, you know, we can get out of here intact. Objective down. Stop shooting me with SRM, you stupid harasser. Die! Die! There we go. Okay. On to the next location. Incoming eagles. That's the centurion they drive. I see it. Eagles to the north. Okay, started hurting the one. Got the one. We're gonna need bigger guns. There we go. That should actually be a decent number of AC-10s. Not that we really have mechs to put them on just yet, but... We can put a PPC on the Centurion if we steal it. <laughs> don't, don't risk Ooh. anything. I want a PPC Centurion. Be risky though. Hi. Got a nice shot right on him though. Alpha, everything I had was like, he's uh, still rocking. Ooh, got a locust coming up on me as well. Ow. Scan the skies. Nope, it's just you. Scorpion light tank. Gotta kill you. Shoot. One leg down. I think I'm shooting a proper leg. Yeah, this leg's almost gone. Leg's gone. Alright, so that's in turn is a 15% chance now, so we can keep on pushing it. And that leg, leg is down. Dead. Derek showed me Rogue Tech wasn't complicated as it looked and got me back in the battle tech even if I second. Oh, thank you, Volonovich. I'm happy to hear that. I like helping to expand the community in any way I can. This is a lot of fun. It's such an interesting and fun universe. It certainly is one that was born in the 80s. <laughs> oh, goodness. Please don't, please don't die, Javelin. What's wrong with the Javelin? Uh, a lot of oh, things. Maybe be a little less aggressive, man. That's Remember, a dream. Like, outside your range. I know. I just got stuck around the corner when they all dropped right on top of me. I was the only one outside that corner. When the next mods come in that give us uh, 
to give us MRMs, we're definitely gonna build. Definitely gonna build javelin. Oh, wow, well, you are. Yep, I'm aiming MRM at it. MRM javelin. Yeah, I think it'll work out quite nicely. Drop Target over here. Acquired. Target destroyed. Nice. Incoming locust. All these Vito pilots are elite, and I don't like that. <laughs> How do you tell that? Oh, I see. Never mind. Yeah, in the bottom right. Yeah. Sorry, target, target them. Acquired. Oh, I'll focus on the locust. See if I can give you some pressure. Oh, he's almost open. It's open. From behind. Just give him a little bit more of a punch to the nose. He should go down, right down. Destroyed. Good kill. Thank you for that. Target acquired. Alright, we've got scorpion tanks. tanks. This ER large laser playstyle is very interesting. It's very much not me, but it is interesting. Because it's like, I'm killing you from basically so far away the game doesn't even know if I'm hitting you or not. Because I've got a 675 meter range on these things. And I think your maximum range is like twice that or 1.5 times that so yeah, we've got it's pretty far yeah got some capability here although i should probably stop pushing my heat so high oh egor i saw her i fly and the egor's dead nice i'm just gonna continue on my way we're just playing sniper wars here pretty much you are i'm running in there like a madman so what we have is a properly working fire support group. Scratch that target off exactly. the list. Exactly. Although with heavy MRMs, we could probably get an even target better one going. Neutralized. If we really wanted to be lazy, we could strip off the SRM6s and put two LRM10s on this thing. Yeah, we could do that. I just don't think the reduction in damage would be all that much fun. And I think he would probably try to kill me for it. Oh goodness, the spider has seen better days. Most of our mechs have, although I still kind of think I can take this crab into a fight. Just as long as I hung it. Oh, yeah, there's two Igors behind us. Oh, I'm turning. I see him. And I'm out of ammo. Get down. Good job. Yeah, that could have been really bad. Was Let's see if we can't just pick off the last of the buildings and get on out of here. Because this is most certainly not meant for as light of a lance as we brought for it. Although, surprising, surprisingly few mediums. Or not mediums, but heavies. Like, none of them so far. Yeah. I think the heaviest thing we saw was I that think some Target buildings have been destroyed, Commander. Right, I am headed for job. that evac. Yeah, getting let's get out of here. Head to the Mort location. Get out where the getting's good. The spider only took armor damage, so it might be ready for the third mission with the rocket. Yeah, crabs in the same way, but it's a medium, so it'll probably take a little bit longer than that, unfortunately. Base is trapping me! <laughs> job well done. That's the problem. I, I got to the ship. Not bad at all. Kicking butt, taking names. Across half the known damage. Oh, I don't damage know, but that's a lot of damage there, really. Right, we're about to find out how much damage we took. If we can grab a couple of mediums, though, that'll make this all worth it. Just for selling them. Mod Centurion. Mod Centurion. Uh, yeah, I know it would be great. GPC Centurion. And a Locust. Ah. Uh. That's it. All locust. For 27 cells. For 27 cells, <laughs> yes. Oh, well, that... we have a lot of weapon systems, I guess. We are tanking well, up our medium lasers. I use my again. armor and my ammunition appropriately. All nice and stripped. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. Neither does the Vindicator look like a pirate when it loses its armor. Dude, like one peg 603. Leg. Nice work. And 63 damage on the I ran out of ammo. <laughs> oh, yeah. Th this lance is surprisingly solid. You have completed one out of three missions. The spider should be ready for the last mission with the repair. 
do I repair this thing or not? Eight days. How long is it in between missions? Six. Like seven or ten? It, it'll tell you when you click on the mission contract in the bottom uh, left of the contract. This, this one to the second one. Right, so if I bring, if I don't bring the crab, if I try to repair the crab, it will not be ready for the final mission. 18 days. 18 days? I thought it was six. No, I'm saying how long the crab repairs. Uh, it's eight days, so I'm two uh, days out. You'll be fine for the third mission, though, I think. No, no, it won't. No. So I think I'll bring the crab on this one, and I'll drop down to my locust in the next one. See if I can't edge it a little bit more out to the as much as I can yeah that's not coming with us and that's not coming with us either Prove indicator repairs in 8 days according to my screen I thought it was like 16 my screen doesn't seem to take into account the uh, oh the additional work time yeah I don't know if that yeah. even went on took a lot of hits on it but yeah, I'm gonna bring I'm gonna bring the crab out again, and I'm gonna see if I can't provide just the long range fire support. I gotta guard my arms jealously though, because they have the ER large lasers that I need. <laughs> Fair locusts. Oh, we better do this fast and hard. <laughs> this, this, yeah. This is gonna it be interesting. Split up for targets. Uh, if we can hit them quick enough, maybe. But that's oh, this be... is Wait, demolition. It's demolition, this one, isn't it? No, we can't do that. No, well, we can just sort of burn in. Please don't you move back. <laughs> By the way, folks, if this happens to be the first time watching us live, make sure you hit that follow button over on Twitch so that you can get notifications every single time we go live. If you happen to check down below, you'll notice several links to things such as our Discord and our YouTube channel where you can catch VODs or hang out with other folks in our community. We would love to have you along for our little group. Alright, so... What mission is this? Demolition? Got an eagle. There's eagle. Lasers have hit. He's starting to turn. Third laser strike again. Oh god, I have no armor. Third laser strike. He's still alive. Stop living. And he's dead. Okay. My temperature's starting to get a little out of control. Oh, great. Uh, yeah, let's push through and see if we can't stop our way through this base as fast as we can, take as little damage as you can, but we are not here to stay. And if that means getting swarmed, uh, so be it. We want to cr crunch this as fast as we can. Ooh, that's a Shadowhawk, though. Mm. Where is it? In the base. Alright, the Shadowhawk is worth grabbing, because we are getting 27 salvage. Curtain this over the also wrecking the base for us. Nice. Which is ingenious because he just triggered reinforcements. Uh, I suppose that is good for him. Oh shoot, took a nap in front of an urban mech. Thank you. My back armor is completely exposed. Okay, there goes his arm. Oh, they have a PPC cicada, watch out. Oh, the PPC cicada? It's a good one. I'm showing heavy damage to a number of the facility structures. Yeah, we do not want to be here. I highly suggest you, you raid and run. Because we are not going to survive this. We almost got this Shadow Hawk down. <laughs> There's not much time to be here, folks. I'm going to start opening up paths for you to get out of here. Get the Shadow Hawk down. Oh, I'm shutting down. I gotta pay more attention to that because it's gonna be the death of me. And we're out of here. Alright, time to flee. Locusts run. That's a one kilometer e bag. What the heck? Well, it's a good thing that you travel at like a hundred and something kilometers because we're gonna need it. I am going. There's also like five cicadas between you and the event points, so run the fast. Stupid wall debris is slowing me down! Oh no! Don't worry. I'm I like 500 away. 
Large laser, large laser look, let's go. Alright, I'm, I'm there. Nice, just in time. Give us a shadow hawk, we earned it. I hope so. Aaron Jesus, take the wheel! 15% chance! This, this is game, we earned it. We have it. Hopefully, we just earned this. Yeah, I kind of shut down after saving Tirak and everybody wanted to kill me. Yeah, I saw that. That looked painful. On the bright side, though, I it's only a locust. Oh, I had to take that cannon out because you shut down right in front of him. Yeah. I was able to, with my next alpha strike, able to take out that cannon because of you. So thank you very much. It was awesome. Alright, what do we I got? Feel right. Absolutely nothing. That's what we got. Highway robbery. We got some good SRM twos in case anybody wants them. Ooh, Fed Jenner and that crab are toasty. Oh yeah, that I got opened like a tin can at right at the end. We got almost everything on the salvage list. Yeah, that's rough. All right, last mission. AFK for like one minute. Oh, never mind. So what do we got left? Uh, we got the we got the fire javelin. We got the urban mech. And that's kind of about <laughs> it. We get the urban mech for a raid mission. Oh boy. Uh, do you want to take the the fire javelin? If in the fire javelin, and I guess that means. Hero crab? We could run her again. It's just you gotta. I gotta watch the back armor. Uh, I don't know. That front armor looks to be kind of toasty. Dicker Harry wants us to abort. I don't think so. I think we can take it. I think we've got it. Moon, moon. I'll trade you the locust for the javelin if you want. The locust is in surprisingly good condition, actually. <laughs> no, nah, the yeah, the locust is pretty good. So I guess we just run it again. Uh, My crab's in rough well, shape, but you know I think I'll, I can make it work. I'll, I'll take the Irby. Someone can take the Locust. Yeah, hey, Jack. Because that one Locust is in actually pretty good condition, and then somebody can take the Javelin, too. Yeah. So the rule for me is minimal taking of damage and don't turn my back to the enemy because otherwise we're going to be in trouble. <laughs> make sure to Make sure to watch your back so they don't drop on you. Front towards the enemy. That's what I need to this have. This is a room. raid, right? Ah, uh, yes. Yes. So as I fast can run as in can. there and destroy everything with the machine guns and then run like hell. That'd be a plan. On it. Gonna be... We're going to hopefully find ourselves a heavy mech at some point. I don't know if we're still going to get the full 27 salvage that we're looking for because the last time we only got 18. Attention. Prepare for battle as long as we can maybe take out like one or two Warning. decent. Yeah, if we can get a heavy out of this one, this will all be worth it. We'll never be able to flip him. Or, yeah, a good medium too. Weapons online. A solid 50 thunder. Really a hunchback would be perfect. Really need to replace this medium laser and just put a large laser because Sprague is a, is a unique. <laughs> Sprague didn't want the PPC. We'll be back to pick you up when the job is done. Good hunting. All right, keep your eyes out for Igor's. They are going to be quite dangerous. Target acquired. Okay, a couple of VTOLs dropping in from, you know, space, apparently. Try not to get too separated, because we don't want to get swarmed and surrounded. Target destroyed. Target acquired. There we go, cycling again. Oof, I'm not in a good position to take damage anymore. Trying to finish off all the VTOLs for us. Looks like we've got some high ground we can push to up here. So if that works, I'm guarding your back. Yeah, we, we should we should hold up and wait for the Remegman. I don't want to lose this firepower. Ooh, destroy one radio tower. If I can see it, I can flank it. It should be just on the edge of my range with the ER largest. Javelin, don't stand in front of me. Target Got down. it. Target acquired. So that's the first target down. 
so they're dropping a dropship north. To our north? Target yeah, destroyed. looks like some vehicles. On the low ground with you, or up higher with us? Uh, by you. Also, there's three Igors coming in from the north. Oh, goodness. Oh, God, I see them, yes. Uh, uh life is about to be very painful Target very quiet. quickly. Got the first one. Shoot, Target got destroyed. the second one. Damn, torso lasers! Oh god, avoided that That's shot. also a Centurion. Laser Centurion. By me. Die, die, by die! Okay, critical. Leg, or my arm is open. Target acquired. Maybe kill the locust first if it's... Whoop. I'll take the locust. Really, I got a headshot in the locust. <sighs> got a toasty little problem going on here. Don't look at me, don't look at me, don't look at me! Not my left arm, not my left arm! He's gonna rob me of my left arm. Oh, I'm offline. No, uh, go away! Go away! Don't don't look, but there's a centurion behind you. Oh good. As long as he doesn't look at my left arm, I'm fine. Oh crap, no, he's actually behind me. I thought it was like ranged. No, no, yeah. He, he. Target acquired. I think we remove his weapons and then we go for his legs. I have no I have no ability to, to move fast. System offline. And slumber. I have gotta stop playing sleepy. Someone can say good crap. Yup. This thing is steamed, man. Steamed. I'm just riding that it. That other leg is almost gone. Yep, left leg. Take it if you can. Oh, we look so hilarious having to all this armor gone. There we go. Drag dolls down. The heck with that locust. Take it a nap. Alright, wake up, locust. Or wake up. There you go. Alright, we're working. This is a spicy mission. We knew it was gonna be. This crab was not meant to fight through all three missions. But it's here now. It's here now, and I'm currently risking one of my ER large lasers. We're gonna cycle around to the outside, take this one over on the right. Target acquired. Target Is there a carrier? Is there a dead? Because if I can. Igor. I missed! Oh. How uh, could I run, miss? Run. Fire at. Oh, I've lost my arm. Damn it! Damn it! Ah, uh, I got the AZ-10 shot off too late. I was trying to jump jet it. But if this mission doesn't give us a Centurion, I'm gonna be so, so sad. Because I just lost one of my ER large lasers, never only got two. Uh, Rather, Ellie geez. had two. Well, on, on brighter news, we could stick the ER large laser in the Irby. We could! <laughs> Sprug would freak out, but we could do it. Oh, it's just because he's... A baby about heat. Yeah. Actually, no, that's kind of funny because he's normally incredibly aggressive about heat. Okay, I've got one VTOL to keep, or one large laser to keep shooting at VTOLs. I see the radio tower. Yeah, radio no. tower is down. We can abandon this base and not get anywhere uh, near it. Run away! Yup! Don't be there! I'm I so will provide slow. suppressive fire. This reminds me of the, the one scene from Banner Brothers. We will provide Eagle suppressive coming in from the fire. West. Uh, can't be a new rare type. Ow! Eagle on the West. Oh, there's the Eagles behind us. That's not good. I saw you like midair shoot that. That was pretty impressive. <laughs> that was, that was, I saw my life flash before uh -oh. my eyes. Th this Jenner is going to ruin my week. I do not have any armor. You got the AC 10 to the back. Come on, die, 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 die. Please ah! explode. Oh, I shot the locust. Oh, shit. Oh. Just watching AC 10 shells fly over the hole. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I think I uh -oh. shot Kyoga by accident. No. Oh, no. It's all good. We needed that. Oh, uh, the pilot may be dead. So I have, um... I've got an open right arm now. It's my only laser left. Both sides, of course, for my medium or my small. But I don't think those count. Stop shooting me with that AC5. <laughs> we got three more targets to destroy. Uh, I'll get there eventually. 
we're really gonna need you to finish this one, aren't we? <laughs> You're probably gonna be the thing that saves us all. Are you faster I, jumping, by the way? You gotta need help over here. Got a uh, spider. Uh, not really, no. There's a spider behind you. Yep, I'm engaged with him. Yeah, jumping makes you go 23 on this uh, Irby. Ah, oh, that's 2-3 Jumbo. And there goes my arrow. So let's just set these to weapon group 1. Because it's all I've got. Maybe have been a mistake to take this uh, take this king this crab into the mission, but I thought I had it. Yeah, all I've got is a small laser and a medium laser, <laughs> and foul language. I bite my thumb at you, sir. It's probably gonna. <laughs> what the hell is that rectal? Run! Go critical! Oh gosh. Oh, shot me in the back. Yeah, we got our max. I'm gonna run for the objectives and try and. I, I can't believe okay. we actually got Good ambushed luck. by an urban mech. We did get ambushed by an urban mech. I. Uh, I'm gonna keep his attention. Trying to remove its arm. And then his other arm. Once he loses both arms, we can ignore him. Ah, uh, you've got vehicles behind you. Oh, I lost the leg. No. Not the leg. God, go away! Cannon! Okay, I got his cannon. He still has a small laser. I have no armor left. My mech is in pieces. Oh boy, this is not good. Oh no, I still have center torso or center armor. Yes, I can fight. As long as my center torso armor exists. Okay, we can ignore him. Just do nothing with him. Oh, is he punching out? He just bailed out. Yeah. Once they have no weapons, they bail. Uh, so I go even slower, just in case you didn't think that was possible. So we've got to kill three targets. Listen, Javelin, it's all up to you. It is. Good I'm just dodging egos at the moment. I can't oh, really God. help you. I've only got a medium laser. How cool would an annihilator look with an Igor hat on? Very odd. It's, it's a very interesting idea. I'm gonna go on ahead and scout. See if I can't grab that last objective and we can just hightail it out of here. I did, I nailed that Igor from nice. downtown. Okay, I got a warrior. A We're just arcing those AC-10 shots. Let it fly! You can do it, I believe in you. I think that nearly hit me. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Objective down. Honestly, it doesn't actually matter if I lose side torsos anymore. Oh wait, no, I. There's a lot of targets here. Shit. Keep running as fast as you can. Gingerbread men and all that. Holy sh! What is that? Oh, of course, I run into the panther. Scratch that target <laughs> off the list. Of course, I run into the panther. Oh What else would goodness. I run into? You oh. have. Oh my god, that crap. It's I'm gonna on die. I'm on my way to the final objective. Come on, hold together, honey. God, those SROs are terrifying. I just need a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Oh god, there's multiple Igors. You weren't kidding. Oh, there's three Igors coming your guys' way. <laughs> Come on, medium Try. laser cycle. Cycle medium laser. What to do. Oh, I don't have a medium laser anymore. Just run for the exit. We and almost got this tower. Take this. Okay, we're run gone. Run. run for it. Ah. Center torso, center torso armor gone. Left torso Your armor center torso gone. Torso is cherry red. Beyond cherry red. Oh god. How is this thing attacked? This thing may not make it through. By the way, we are playing the dead is dead rule. If any mech goes down to the center torso, we've got to sell it. So. Run! It's right there. You can do it. Go, go! I'm shooting the eagle. Big back! Big back! <laughs> oh my god! Me! <laughs> Me! Saved! Yes. yes. There are so many eagles here. We've got it. We've got it. <laughs> oh, yes. 
crab survived. Three missions in that crab. You don't even know what was behind. There were five <laughs> Igors. I believe it. I saw three of them. Yes, Redgar, it was a rough mission. That was great. Hero crab. Thank you, Laser Kitten, man. By the way, if this is your first time watching us, make sure you hit the follow button so that we know that you like what you're seeing. Oh, thank you. Thank if you, we everyone. Don't get We're not going to get a mech out of it. Record that I've had. That, that is the exact same thing that happened. <sighs> I'm this. That's it. We never worked. Uh, no, really? Again. All of that? All of that for nothing. I gave up two large lasers for these people. How do they repay us? We're never working for Davy never again. Not just large lasers, ER large lasers. I gave up lost technology for these people. We also gave up the locust. Yes, we <laughs> did lose the locust. That is in there. torso's gone. It's yes, just uh, mother torso's and head. Yep, she's a soul. On the bright side, Freeman didn't die. Freeman yes, is alive. We knew he Surprisingly, the locust is dead, but the locust took the least amount of damage. <laughs> Where what? Yep, it uh, took 66 damage. It's possible I may have hit it with an AC-10. Okay. I know I hit it with the blazes and then it exploded. I was shooting the Jenner and I think, I mean, yeah, it's, it's a possibility. <laughs> okay, this locust goes into cold storage, will be sold the moment we get to a, well, we're going to a contract planet right now. Surprisingly, the Irby didn't lose its AZ-10. Hey, there's a fire starter. Oh, can I just sell the locust here? I should be able to, shouldn't you can I? can if there's a market. I think there should is. Say so They say that you can sell from cold storage, but apparently not. They lied to us. Okay, so it's the 1V with the center. It's, it's the, the 1V, 1V with, with no both, weapons. Yes. <laughs> Both 1Vs are currently torsoless. Uh, this one. Goodbye. So there happens to be a fire starter right now in the market for 2 million sea bills. I think that's actually a really reasonable price. I think that's a pretty good price. Yeah. We're currently getting 25% off all Davian purchases. You just have to scroll down. Right. That's a pretty good price. I, mean, I guess we can semi forgive them. Not really. No, they, they cost us two million sea bills to buy that thing. <laughs> we forgive nothing. <sighs> Alright, so we need to head back to um, to all mech because there's a hero mech there. And that then we'll, we can't afford? Uh, Potentially. We'll see what we need to sell. If it's any good. I mean, it might be a terrible hero mech. Right now, I wouldn't be necessarily opposed to selling my crab because it's in pieces. Keep scrolling down your cold storage. Mech show up underneath others. Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh, oh, it's a firebrand. <laughs> oh, baby. That is... How expensive is that, though? Yeah. 13 million Siebels. Yeah, we're never buying well, that. We can't afford it. I mean... As much as I would love yeah. to sell all of my stuff for it, we it's just outside the price range. God, my favorite that's... way of running a firebrand is twin AC-20s. Just <laughs> running it around. Oh. Macquarie oh. Online days. It's got an excellent endo. That, that's because because you got to remember folks if you're if you're no if you're familiar with Battletech you know that an XL engine means side torso destruction the whole mech is dead that's not the case in Mech Warrior 5 they didn't implement that system so basically you have a super engine that just weighs half the weight that's frustrating Getting more space for things yup lots of space more space for boom at least it doesn't die yet <laughs> well I think the standard build is BPC, so it should be a favorite for you, man. All right, yeah, we don't have 13 million, so that's not happening. Let's go fix all of our junk. <laughs> oh my god, I only lost one double heatsink. We're gonna replace. Uh, we don't have any large lasers. We don't. I'm gonna check the mm. shop. Because we're gonna need a lot of gear here. Hey, good, they've got one large laser in the shop. Gotta love Davian. Uh, that one locust had a large laser. Oh, that was the one that got blown up. So that's what happened to the large laser. Right. 
Right. Mm. Do you have PPCs in the market? No, no, they don't. They don't have a lot of gear in this market. This market is terrible. <laughs> I want to speak to this market's manager. <laughs> Hello, Greybird. Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. Yeah, we, we just managed to come off a mission that was, what, a level, two levels higher than what we were supposed to be doing? And we survived. So we're doing pretty well. Just. Just. All right, so we need Check to fix barracks, it. too. Ah, yes, the barracks. Meet you in the ready room. Uh, 22 is a good pilot. Meet you in the ready room. Affirmative. We can take these two pilots. Well, They're decent. I've trained for this. Just in case we need backup for. Oh, we're gonna need backup. <laughs> All right, let's build the fire starter. So, we do all... have to have good friend. Hmm. Our money. <gasps> what happened to all our money? Fire starter. <laughs> I thought I had a million sea bills after that. No, we had like 800 something, and then we traveled, and then. Yeah. Uh, and then it does cost money to buy pilots. That is true. I just didn't think it cost a lot of money. All right, we'll just repair what we can then. Ooh, my little, my little Bernie one. He lost most of his capabilities. Uh, the Irby's repaired. It gonna... did. It it did well. It did. It survived. I'm still disappointed we got uh, ambushed by an Irby. That's <laughs> hilarious. It's like, surprise! So we'll see what we can fix just for f more or less free. Uh, the Nasty's good. The Crab is not. Uh, might be actually worth putting the Crab in cold storage for now. Because that'll make our monthly costs a little bit cheaper. We'll do the same thing with the Fire Starter. So those two are currently not, you know, available. Uh, this javelin can be repaired. This javelin can be repaired. No, it can't. Gotta sell some things. To the market! Energy weapons. I happen to have 30 lasers. Take a whole bunch of them. There we go. And jump jets that we don't use. There we go. Almost a million sea bills again. So that'll make life a little bit more comfortable. Prepare the javelin. And I don't know why we have this locust. Eh, maybe we can just sell it. That's what I'm thinking. Get a little bit of seed money out of that one. Oh, that's cool. A little bit of a cushion. So where's the busted locust? There it is. 1.5 million sea bills. Yeah, we can work with that. Star map. So we need to make buy money. Firebrand. Yes, we need to make money to buy a firebrand. Seven or six. Honestly, we should probably pick a lower zone. <laughs> well, the only reason why that one was so hard is because it threw us into a three mission in a row. Other than that, it actually wasn't that bad. Like, individually, all of those missions were totally doable. Yeah. That it's final just, raid mission, though, was a little ridiculous at this Igor. Now nah, we could have taken it if we were all at full health. Because we wouldn't have been so gun shy about taking any damage. That's true. Raid contract true. times two. Demolition. So I changed the Irby around. What'd you do? It has a large laser and an AC5. Interesting. <laughs> well, so my thinking is it's slow, but if it can get like a good vantage point for the distance, it could help us. All right, so we're going to pull in a system here. So there's a firebrand right nearby, which is really expensive, but has <laughs> really good kit. We really need to get our hands on that. But we are pretty much at the end of the stream. So, uh, first things first, I'm going to say goodbye to YouTube. So, to just to YouTube, uh, thank you very much for watching. I have been t -Rack. If you like what you've been seeing, hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see a notification every single time I post one of these videos. Press the little bell icon, leave a comment, and I'll see you all in the next episode.